Hull House. It's a potent blend of twisty plot lines and insane action that'll keep your eyes glued and your brain rotting, as your high school teacher used to say. And to speed things up, we created Hulu. Hulu beams so many free shows right to your computer. It'll simmer your head meat down to a bubbling, brainy fondue. Useless to you, delicious to us. Because we're aliens, that's kind of our thing. Hulu, an evil plot to destroy the world. Enjoy. Greetings, Earth friends. I'm Seth MacFarlane. You know, the next time someone says, TV rots your brain, laugh. Laugh hard. That laughter will force our televised intoxicants deep into your cerebellum, slowly rotting it into a quivering blob of tapioca. Yeah, and to finish it off, we got Hulu. Hulu blasts enough free TV to your lappity toppity boxes to turn your chunky gray matter uh, uh, into creamy goo matter. <laughs> Giggity. Giggity goo. Who wants chowder? Because we're aliens. And that's our gig. Hulu, an evil plot to destroy the world. Enjoy. Come here. It's time for a little come to dentist meeting. Your parents were right, your teachers were right, even that creepy scout master with the tight brown shorts was right. TV is slowly rotting your brain and turning it into a slimy, gooey, mushy blob of pudding, and there's nothing you can do about it. See? I just told you what was happening, and you're still watching TV. Amazing. But this whole slowly part is getting to be a real problem. Well, guess what? Who Hulu. We built Hulu to pump thousands of hours of free TV right into the one screen you drag around everywhere. Hence... Now I need you to take your stubby little human fingers and hit this button on Hulu. Then you can share those TV shows in your bliggity blogs and your facey spaces and your tweety pages for all your bookwormy anti boob to be friends. So here's the deal. Help us churn their finely cultured skull beef down to the aforementioned pudding and we'll slurp out yours last. Eh? Yeah. Because we're aliens. And you ain't soup yet. Hulu, an evil plot to destroy the world. Enjoy. Hello, Earth. I'm Alec Baldwin, TV star. You know, they say TV will rot your brain. <laughs> That's absurd. TV only softens the brain like a right. What's going on, y'all? So today I wanted to talk about um, how Hollywood is basically mocking you. And I say this because when they do shit like, you know, put shit on TV and these commercial like those commercials I just showed you. They're being a hundred percent with y'all. Like they being dead ass serious. Like when they do shit like this, it ain't nothing but a fucking inside it's an inside joke to them. But they know that they've dumbed people down enough to the point where, you know what I'm saying, you can just pop out with the shit and people will pay no mind to it. Like, literally, what they were saying in that video was, your brain is turning to must. Like, literally, that's the whole reason why this TV and all of this shit was designed. Because if you don't know, like, the phone I'm recording on, like, the laptop you use, the game you on, you know, the TV, whatever. It's all created to destroy you. Why is this phone emitting so much radiation? Why is... You know, you know what I'm saying? Why is the, the, the AirPods constantly, you know, uh, I forgot it was emitting some shit. It was like some type of frequency or something. And it just kept going and going even when you're not using them. You know what I'm saying? Why is there a blue light in every screen that's designed to directly attack my pineal gland? You know what I'm saying? And furthermore, why are these programs being created just so people can develop the lifestyle that they see on television. Why? Television. Telling you a vision. But it's just crazy that you can sit a person in front of the television and watch them as they start to develop, like getting used to just sitting around watching fucking TV. You know what I'm saying? Stripping you of the time that you could be finding to, you know, find it for yourself. Like, I don't know if y'all know this, but as time goes on, like, they really stripped us of nature. 
And I, I, I understand I'm, I'm going around and I'm going in loops and shit. Like, just, just hear me. Because those who actually understand and know what's up, it'll be easy for them to understand my message. I, you know, I... I don't, I don't, I'm not a man in the suit. I can't give it to you perfect. You know what I'm saying? I can only just talk. But I don't want to stray off subject too much. But they have stripped us of nature. They took us out of, you know, the grass and put us in a fucking square. You know what I'm saying? They took us away from the birds and, the, and, the, and, the, and the, you know, and the animals. And they gave us cell phones and all types of shit. So back to my point, what I was saying, people see these programs and they start to develop. Like today, you got fucking loving hip hop. You know what I'm saying? All of that shit. Nine times out of 10, the people that watch those fucking uh, reality shows and shit, they act just like the people that they watch. Either they're inspired, you know what I'm saying? That they, they, they influenced by them or that's just how their actual lifestyle is. They don't portray nothing good on television. It's all sports, sex, uh, drugs. You got power, Netflix. You got fucking pedophilia, all types of uh, 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 gay shit being promoted, all types of shit. It's nothing normal or educational besides the fucking uh, the History Channel. And even they still be put bullshitting with y'all on there. But... Y'all got to realize that all of this shit is designed to destroy you. And me coming out saying this shit, bro, I, I say this many times and I'm going to keep on saying it. You can't really tell this to the common man. But when you when you actually speak to them, they ego going to fight it. But their soul is going to really know what's up. You feel me? And they're going to think about it at the end of the day. Like, damn, like. I do sit up all my fucking day and basically I'm giving my life away to this system. And what the system is, they put you through, it's like they putting you through the ringer consistently. It's like they put you through these fucking gauntlets. You start off with the school curriculum. Then from there, you got to get a fucking job. Then after you get a job, you got to worry about bills you got to worry about all of that shit until you can finally sit the fuck down and find time for yourself. But you can't find time for yourself because you're on TV. You're on TV. You're on fucking TikTok. You're on YouTube all fucking day without having any type of real development or actually trying to grow your mind. And motherfuckers who sit up on YouTube and or, or, or TV and watch TV all day it's like this shit is ridiculous because even after you're done with that tv you still got to go out into the world filled with a bunch of other motherfuckers who are brainwashed after you got that tv you got politics then you got to worry about religion then you got to worry about all of this shit that was created that was given to you you didn't have no say so it was just there like think about that you didn't have no say so in religion, uh, schools, uh, you know, watching football and all that shit. You just got to grew accustomed to it. And it was just, it was there. And then you grew accustomed to it because everybody else is doing it. Then when you find yourself, you know, when you, when you that person like me who doesn't get sports, that shit is boring. Just sitting there watching a nigga run up and down the field or run up and down the court. When you get to a point where you actually like to stick your feet in the grass and you like to sun gaze and you like to meditate, you get looked at as fucking crazy. Because like they said in the fucking commercial, you got motherfuckers whose brains turn to mush. And the reason why they're mocking you is because, like they said, again, in the commercial, they eat it. They do. They do this shit. Brains, hands, are These people do not. These people are sick. And I'm talking about your Joe Bidens and your, your motherfucker. All your motherfuckers who are in the entertainment industry and the political systems, judicial systems. All of these motherfuckers. Because at the end of the day, these motherfuckers are the ones who are grouping up at night to be sacrificing and eating motherfuckers and doing all this sick ass shit. And then next thing you know, it's on TV. 
it's on your, your, your programming. They call it programming for a fucking reason. It's on these fucking commercials where they can come out and say this shit and joke about it right in front of your fucking face. And you don't want to believe it because you're sitting watching TV, watching sci-fi and watching all this shit, not believing that all this shit actually exists. It's just being portrayed as a fucking joke and something that's not serious. So, like I said, when you come to a person and say to them, like, hey, you know these motherfuckers are really lizards. You know these motherfuckers are evil. You know these motherfuckers, they're snatching children. You get looked at as fucking crazy. Like, what are you talking about? That only happens in the movies. That only happens uh, in, in Star Wars or fucking any of those damn shows. How can you not see the destruction that's going on right now? They got motherfuckers hooked on power, loving hip hop, Netflix. What is what is all of that? Drugs. You know what I'm saying? Uh, sex, pedophilia. You know, uh, gay shit, all types of shit. And it's not that I'm against you know gay people. Don't try to turn it into nothing like that. I'm just saying when it comes down to shit like that, they like to target the children. They after everybody. Don't get it fucked up. But they're trying to target the children. The most when it comes down to this shit. Now, I'm not trying to, you know, most of my videos lately has, has been me ranting. It's just, I don't, I don't come scripted. I'm not a nigga, like I said, I'm not a nigga in a suit that's giving y'all, I'm, I'm giving y'all the actual truth. I'm only here to make y'all think. I'm not here to incite no violence, no none of that shit. Because you know that's what they like to say when you're speaking the truth. When you're trying to wake people the fuck up. They are distracting you on a constant basis. YouTube. You know, even though you got people like me and other people that speak the truth on here. There's plenty of bullshit that overrides that. Which is why I'm stuck in, you know, at what I got. And people are stuck at, you know... They deleting people channels and blocking motherfuckers and deleting comments and all types of shit. <clears throat> they are distracting you. I don't know what it's going to take for you to wake the fuck up. But they are distracting you from what? From all the sick shit that I have talked about that they have done in previous videos. That they're still doing today that they've been doing since the dawn, since they landed here, since they got here. They distracting you with the fucking news, racism, religion, po politics, school, your job. And then you got to worry about the other stupid motherfuckers who either with this shit that they with or they brainwashed. Because they had, they share the same genetic makeup or they share, share the same face. They right along with the shit. You got to worry about those people. The bots. Like, I, I honestly don't know what to say. You know what I'm saying? But just pay attention. If the truth is being revealed as we speak. I... I mean, that's all I really had to say. I want to talk about this shit more, but I know people don't even be really watching through all these videos like that. And we going on like 10 minutes or so, but this shit is crazy. It's just crazy. On a constant basis, they are distracting you. So you can't even find the time to meditate because now they got y'all focused on the shit that's going on over in fucking Afghanistan. What? Hmm. I don't know. I just feel like, man, it, it's, it's time for y'all to know the truth. Because you got people like me that's trying to tell you. Nobody's going to tell you. These motherfuckers are not going to tell you. They're going to tell you the truth. But they're going to twist it and mix it around with a fucking lie. To make it seem like, you know, they're actually telling you something when they're not. Over here... Or anybody else that's on the same type shit. We're going to tell you the truth. And I feel like everybody deserves to know the fucking truth. 
But yay, yeah, it's up to y'all, man. Y'all got to realize y'all got fucking you have free will. You don't have to partake in this bullshit, these this this religion or the religion they pushed in front of you, the politics, the entertainment, you know, uh 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 work. You don't have to partake in none of that. And what they doing right now is trying to make it seem like they they trying to shut the water down and poison the water and do all that shit. It happened over here. Um, they trying to uh make it seem like uh they trying to strip motherfuckers of their food. That's what they doing in foreign countries right now. Trying to make it seem like once they're gone, we're not going to be able to live without them. When little do people know, we were prosperous before they even got here. All we need is time to rebuild. We don't need these motherfuckers here. These parasites. That's what I call them. But, you know, I, I ain't going to talk too much more, man. Uh, I hope y'all really listen to this message. Because I'm not saying this shit for the likes or the views or the, you know, to be the most popular and all that shit. I really genuinely want y'all to know this shit and start to realize what the fuck is going on. But that's all I really had to say for today, man. Make sure y'all comment down below and let me know how y'all feel about this. Like the video. Subscribe if you haven't already. Um, This shit is, uh, this shit is crazy. But that's all I had to say, man. I'm out.